So do I have any advice on dating? Absolutely. First, understand what dating is. Dating is to get to know. It's as simple as that. You are getting to know the other person. That's what it's about. So we go out and we should get into conversation, not into bed. We get into conversation. Why? So we can get to know. If you are looking for just a bit of a hit, sure, do whatever, but we're not talking about that. If you're seeking relationship, get to know the other person. Don't make early decisions. Oh, wow, he's beautiful. It's, she's there, she's there. No, 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 no. Get to know. We don't know someone after one, two, three, four, five dates. We don't know. All we know is what they want us to understand about them. So take your time. Be patient. Know your worth. Be authentic. You want someone to fall in love with you and therefore you need to be authentic. You need to be you because that's what you can maintain. You see, if you submit your will early, if you fall into a pattern of what they like, it won't last. And then you'll start trying to pull away. And then you'll start trying to speak up, but you won't be heard because they're going, hang on a minute, you weren't that person, you've changed. And you'll be feeling, no, I haven't changed. I haven't cha I've always been like this. But perhaps you weren't authentic at the start. Perhaps you were too accommodating at the start. And perhaps you got into a relationship with someone that likes the person that you thought they wanted to be with as opposed to the person that you are. You have to know your worth. You have to know your identity. In order to start dating, first you need to be in a relationship with yourself. There's a Canadian dating coach out there and she talks about no kissing for three months. And I don't necessarily share that rule, but what I do share and I do take from that is take your time and get to know. You're awesome, stay strong.